podcast. Bath, Ellis. Hello. Hi, uh, Mr. Abbott. Hi, sir. Yes, sir. How are you? Great, How mate. You? I'm doing super. Yeah, Thanks for yeah. asking. Yeah, yeah, How's, yeah, that Carol, yeah, yeah. How's, that Carol, how's that Carol getting on? Carol's anyway? doing right? just fine. Yeah. Yeah, she's doing Christmas carols. <laughs> oh? But anyway, I digress. Hmm. I digress. It, it, one of your colleagues... Now... Hello? Yes. Yeah, anyway, one of your colleagues... <laughs> Hello? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, Hello? Um, mm-hmm. Shut up. Was one... Hello? Was one of the only... Uh, Bill Hind. One of my colleagues well, was one of the only Bill Hind. Did you just say that? Was, yeah, no. Yeah, yeah he, the, the one and only, the late Bill Hiner. Who's that? From... Uh, he's radio presenter from the BBC. One of my um, colleagues. Well, he was colleague, yes, then. Um, however, can I just uh, pause you? Can I uh, just hold you there just for a moment, uh, Ellis? Is uh, is is this something I want to take? Sorry, Nick. I needed my headphones on that. Uh, yes. Is this a call I want to take, Ellis? Why not? <laughs> why not? Well, Stand- I've got a whole list of reasons so far. Why not? OK. Ellis. I, sh- I shoved a shark in my roof. You shoved a shark in your roof? Yes. Because- well, that makes oh, as much sense as anything else you've said so far. No. Are, you, you, are you the bloke with a oh, shark? Oh, wait, wait a minute. Oh. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Pause. Just take a breath. Are you the bloke with the shark on his roof? I put it in there and sold it to Bill Hyman from the BBC. Okay, so it's not really getting, uh, it's not making any more sense. So I'll just leave it there. I'll just drop it uh, by the side of the road uh, like a bag of uh, doggy do. <laughs> or I'll tie it to a tree like people do, like um, <laughs> the world's worst Christmas tree ornament. Why do they do that? What's the point of collecting doggy do in a bag and then tying it to a tree what i mean why go through the process of collecting it and then tying it to a tree why don't you just leave it there if that's what you're going to do that mystifies me as much as pretty much anything else has happened on this show so far and i know it's not my fault yvonne says uh, how far did rod stewart get with repairing a